welcome to my channel. My name is Kim. Welcome to Kim's Beauty Basics. Today I have an exciting video for you. We've skipped the fall. We've gone straight to winter. Holiday set. Just kidding. It is still fall, but uh, the holiday sets for many companies have released. I have had this for a couple weeks actually, so they released it really early. This is the Stila Stay All Day Liquid Lip Set, the Star Studded 8 as they like to call it. It's their holiday liquid lip set. Um, from Stila Cosmetics. So you'll get the ins and outs of this liquid lip set. I will give you my thoughts. You'll see swatches. You'll get all that. So just stay tuned for that. If you like what you see, hit that like button down below. <laughs> and if you want to see more of my content, just hit that subscribe button. I have been wearing these liquid lips for the past couple weeks, so it's not just a first impressions video, really. I can tell you my thoughts on the wear time and everything like that. And I've been wearing it to work and stuff like that, so I can definitely uh, speak to the wear of it. So don't worry, you are not just getting a first impressions in a five minute wear time kind of thing. So you will get the ins and outs and all my thoughts on this liquid lip. There's not much else to say, so we will get right into the video. Before getting into the swatches, I will just show you uh, the packaging. So this is the set here, really cute packaging. So it has white packaging with a gold uh, trim, which has studs, which is cute for the star studded eight. It obviously has two shimmer shades and then uh, the uh, six matte shades. So the two shimmer shades are new to the uh, Stila Stay All Day liquid lipstick line. Um, there also are two shades that are new in the mattes as well. Rubino, which is a beet red matte color, um, is new, and then also Sogno, the warm rose color, is also new. They say that these are creamy matte full coverage liquid lipsticks that stay in place for up to six hours of continuous wear. I can vouch for the wear. I have worn these shades um, to work, and I work. Uh, I worked for about uh, 12 hours. I did have to touch up when I ate or after I ate, but other than that, like up until the eight hours when I did take a break, it was on there. It was stay and put. They do not transfer. They're very matte, but they don't dry out your lips too much. I would definitely say apply like a lip balm, make sure your lips are well hydrated, exfoliate, all that stuff, and then put it on. You'll definitely um, get a little bit better of a look with it. So just keep that in mind. It is enriched with vitamin E and avocado oil, so it is supposed to hydrate your lips or nourish them, as it says. It dries down, girl. It dries down. So this is right now re retailing for $45 on Stila Cosmetics and also Sephora.com. In Canada, it also is at Shoppers Drug Mart. Um, the $45, though, is the Canadian, or sorry, the American price. Um, it is is saying that you get an $88 value uh, with the set. Um, so you're saving a little bit money by getting the holiday set here. Each liquid lipstick is 1.5 milliliters or 0 0.05 fluid ounces. So I'm gonna show you swatches of each of the shades. Just so you know, in between, I'm just um, removing it with a makeup wipe and some Garnier micellar water and, and then just going back in and applying the next shade. Not doing anything fancy, no lip liner, nothing like that. I do use my beauty blender sometimes if there's any redness and just cover it up with some foundation. No uh, concealer, no um, lip line or nothing like that. So these are the swatches with basically my bare lips. Just getting into the swatches, this is the first shade here. It is in the shade Perla. It is the lightest shade out of the bunch. It's a little bit light uh, of a dusty pink, light dusty pink color. Um, I do like it. It dries down super fast. It's already like completely transfer resistant here guys it is not budging and i don't even think i've it's less than a minute since i've applied no complaints here it's a little bit drying i do have super dry lips so i'm apologize for that but it kind of shows you what it looks like if you did have really dry lips but i do have really dry lips right now um it got really cold today and the carmex is not helping too much i will go now to the next darkest shade can I talk? I'm gonna go to the next darkest shade, which is also a dusty pink color, just a little bit darker. All right, so I'm back with Patina. So this is the second darkest shade, I would say, or it's another pink shade. It's a little bit of a darker dusty pink. Um, here's the shade. It's really pretty. It's super opaque. Um, this is in a very sheer formula. It is very matte though, so it like does settle into like lines and stuff like that. Very, very transfer proof. They dry down and like, they feel almost like nothing on my lips, which is great. It doesn't have like a heavy feeling or a tightness to it. Um, just like a nice, um, nice liquid lip. You don't feel it. I like it. All right, so we're back and I just put on Aria, which is this darker pink again. Um, definitely a deeper color though, a lot more pigment to it. So definitely the most punch and the boldest color so far out of the group. Um, but yeah, this is it. All right, so on my lips now is the shade Rubino. 
I don't know where they're getting these names from. Um, but anyway, this is the shade Rubino. It is a dark, like, brick or copper. I don't know. It's like a, oh, it's a cross between like a, like in the package, it looks almost orange. And then on my lips, it looks like a deep red color. Um, it's, it's a cool shade. I would say it went on a little bit patchier than the other shades. I mean, it's kind of expected with such a deep dark shade. So it took a while to get the color even. I don't even think it's really that even now. I don't know if I did such a great job with like the placement of it, but I just wanted to show you the shade. As I progress through this, my lips are getting more and more mad at me, and it's getting a little bit harder to swatch, and my standards are falling quite low as far as um, my application. So this is the shade Urbino, and I did this basically going across um, the palette and then saving the shimmers for last. All right guys, so I'm back with Chianti. This is it in the tube. As you can see, it applies very dark. I didn't think out of this tube it was gonna look this dark. It did to take a little bit of coaxing to get it uh, to this opaqueness. So this was a little bit harder, I would say, to apply. A little bit more patchy or streaky, I would say. And then just had to build up the color. But overall, like once you let it dry and then put on another coat, it definitely builds up to full cover or built up to an opaque um, color application so you just got to be a little bit more patient with it I apologize my it's just getting worse okay it's getting hard we're 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 pretty deep into this swatching so let's go to the next color all right so here's the last matte shade it is in the shade Sogno I have worn it on my channel before in previous videos I've usually topped it with a lip gloss or lip topper um, so I don't know if you've noticed it but I did use it for a couple of my Halloween looks but anyway this is the shade Sogno it is a very light brown shade it is really nice though i would say it's a little light on me i like to add something on top of it either gloss or something like that or layer it on top of a darker brown shade for the ombre look it is really nice very pigmented and easy to apply because it's in a light nude shade so there's that that's the last matte so now we'll get into the two shimmers all right so we're into the shimmers now my lips are feeling a lot better with the shimmer on so this is patina shimmer which is the shade here in the bottle definitely does have some shine to it it is a nice pink color. It does, still does dry down like very matte, guys. Like it's still not transferring. Um, so just keep that in mind. But it does have a shimmer to it. Super nice for the holidays. It, I like this color. Like it's not too intimidating to wear. I would say you could pull this off for daytime as well as night. So it's a really cute color. So we'll go to our final shade, which is a shimmer as well, which is super holiday Christmassy, I think. Um, so we will get right to that. All right, guys. Last but not least, the grand finale here. This is the shade baso shimmer so this is one of the new shimmer shades that is in the collection i don't know if it's picking up well on camera but it is a awesome metallic red color for the holidays it is so bright it definitely makes your teeth look whiter which i love and it just has like this really pretty shimmer it just reminds me it, it screams christmas it screams christmas which i love it is so beautiful if you're looking for a really great gift ah, the shade um, if you were just looking to get a single of the shades, I would say that this is the shade that I would buy. All right, so we'll get right into my final thoughts. As you saw in the swatches, these are really pigmented shades, varies from matte to shimmers, from light um, pinks to a light brown to some lighter, uh, some darker pinks, and then that dark, deep purple, and then even a deeper red brick color. So it has a wide variety. This set, I would say all the shades are really beautiful. Some apply a little bit better than others, as you saw in the swatches, but overall, really great selection of shades, and the quality of these liquid lipsticks is amazing as well. Again, favorite is definitely the Spaceo Shimmer. I think it is perfect for the holidays, and uh, just a really beautiful shade in general. Like, it is great, guys. It might not be coming up as great on camera, Again, I have very dry lips. That was eight liquid lipsticks swatched on my lips, so they are kind of mad at me and a little bit dry, but it still looks really good, I would say. So my final verdict on the Stila Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick Star Studded 8 um, package or holiday set is definitely a big thumbs up. I really enjoy the collection. Um, so if you haven't tried any of the Stila Stay All Day Liquid Lips, this might be a great way to get into it. If you have any questions, let me know down below. I hope you enjoyed the video. I really enjoyed doing it. Uh, these are really fun liquid lips. Definitely my lips are a little bit mad at me, but that's okay. It is all for you guys. If you did like this video, give it a big thumbs up. It helps me out, guys. If you want to hear more from me, just hit that subscribe button and hit that bell notification to get a notification every time I post, which helps you find my videos faster. 
if you want to follow me on social media I'll put my social media handles up here and there'll be links down below so you can just click them and go right to my pages and hit that follow button thank you so much for tuning in guys I hope wherever you are you're having an amazing day and I will see you very soon this lipstick is so nice okay focus Oh, this sweater is so itchy now. Oh, it's killing me.